This video will be about how the young Brebas turned out after being unprotected for the whole winter of 2020 through 2021. Look at these big trees. The branches are covered in ice. Oh, there's no way I can get out there and get the ice off of these, but we'll see. Starting them out now, so. Let's see how they are. Oh, still green under there. Oh, this is the heart of Chicago. I think if any of them are going to survive this ice storm, any of these buds to survive will be Chicago hardy. Before the winter was over, we'd have two ice storms and a few snowstorms. The snow here gets at most a few inches and usually melts within a few days. Today's April 1st, 2021, and looks like these LSU purple are, survived the winter good. The top branches, the tips, which usually die back, um, are actually producing brebas this year. Um, this is the fourth winter we've had this tree in the ground here in Virginia's. And I think it's getting stronger. But um, it was our first tree to actually starting to get green buds after the winter. And those little brebas there. Brebas are figs that form on the last year's wood. And so the little figs here, figlets, I like to call them, they should be ripe in 90 days if all goes well. The main crop of figs will grow later on this year's new wood. The LSU purple doesn't seem to have done very well in the last cold snap. Today's April 13th and the brebas that were on the tree on April 1st seem to have disappeared or dried up. It's hard to tell what happened if they're gonna be able to come back after that. They're just not the same. This tree is Atriano and it's going into its third spring here in ground in this spot in front of the chicken, old chicken house. And it gets a lot of chicken droppings and feathers on the ground around it. So it's getting brebas this year. And now it's getting lots of brebas. All up in here. Atriano is known for its excellent brebas, although I've never tried them. I've read about them in forums. I'm looking forward to trying some. Yeah. It's April 1st. We're expecting another cold snap tonight. Maybe a hard freeze. So I hope they'll survive. April 13th. These brebas from the Atriano fig tree survived the last cold snap, are doing well. Chicago Hardy has leaves, which I have been following very closely all winter and spring. And they are finally, definitely present. I gotta go in, oh, it's raining. April showers bring me flowers. Sometimes it's hard to tell what is a new fig leaf forming or a breba because the fig leaves sometimes come out rounded. The brebas tend to look like little green olives. Here's one now. April 15th. The little Chicago hardy breba. Looking nice. They're just getting bigger and bigger. The little leaves are unfurling like flags. And there are brebas on almost every branch that I can see here. Well, I think that's all for now for this video. And 
we'll definitely post updates on how the breeder babies are doing. So, see you then. Happy gardening. <laughs>